Hi there everyone, today I've made a fan art for the channel called What the Thrift here on YouTube. Lately I've been on a video marathon watching everything from where they started to well now and I love every minute of it. While binge watching I thought why not make a speed paint and so here we are. Before I talk about this piece I'll briefly summarize on what their channel is about. Okay, so here we go. What the Thrift is a channel where a mother and daughter known as Mommy and Gracie share their findings of the craziest, bizarre, or straight-up terrifying things that can be found at local thrift stores that shouldn't be sold. Their reactions are just priceless and I really think are worth watching repeatedly. I'll definitely post links of their channel down below and I totally recommend you check them out. And also, I, I am making SV paint, so usually if I'm doing that, they're worth checking out. <laughs> the line work was at first a bit challenging to work on, as you might have noticed earlier, but once I switched to Fire Packet instead of Many Bang, then things started to get a whole lot easier. I don't know what was wrong with Many Bang at the time, but I'll be sure to figure that out another day. One thing I loved working on was Mommy and Gracie's expressions. I wanted to make sure to capture their first reaction of opening a box inspired by their What the Fan series, and uncover whatever weird junk that might be that might be inside. This is something that I was really happy with in the end. While working on the line work for Gracie, I wanted to fix some of the mistakes I, I made with the sketch, mostly with the proportion of the face. Um, the eyes really bugged me, and also the distance between the, where the mouth was was not truly accurate on how Gracie, Gracie's face actually was, and I really didn't like that, so slowly you'll be watching me fix Gracie's face entirely. Okay, I think that's all I really have to talk about for the line work, so I'll just put on some music for right now, and I'll be back once we reach the coloring stage. Talk to you soon. Okay, I wonder how many times I've actually said okay in this video. Hey, this is my first commentary, so I'll just pretend that didn't happen. <laughs> anyway, for the coloring, there were times where I didn't have a lot of difficulty and others where I found myself working even harder to fix mistakes. Like before, I'll real quick talk about what I really liked work, working on in this piece and then the areas where I had more of a challenge with. The part of just getting the basic color down for Mommy and Gracie was probably the only time where I felt comfortable on actually knowing what I was doing. I would go back and forth to their videos to get an idea on what they would look like so I, would have, I wouldn't have to blindly choose the colors that I would want to use. One thing I did notice, however, is that the color scheme for Mommy and Gracie looked kind of plain because of this. and so. I had to come up with an idea on where the light source would be coming from and how to add more, I don't know, depth to the piece. And that's where I had the idea for a weird green glow coming from inside the box to help add the um, add to the mystery and horror that the two are in. The main struggle I had was with the designs on the t-shirts, Gracie's shirt in particular. The image itself was simplistic, but I wasn't really sure on how to actually draw it on the shirt that I've already colored. In the end, I drew a rough sketch on what the design looked like and used the tool, eraser tool to erase the areas on where I wanted to change color or not have colored at all. It took a while, but the method worked, eventually. Mommy's was a bit 
easier to draw because it's a fan of, of Mickey Mouse. So I just drew the shapes of Mickey and left it at that. I can't think of what else to talk about, so I think I'll wrap it up here. Feel free to like and subscribe if you haven't already, and be sure to check out What the Thrift. It's totally worth it. As always, I hope you guys like the end result, and have an awesome weekend. Bye!